up you guys welcome back to the channel really quick before we get into the video I just wanted to let you guys know because this video took about a month to record I don't want it to get confusing for you guys so just know that there's a lot of different clips from a lot of different days of building my dream Evo 10 without further ado let's get into the vlog What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. So we're doing another video on Barry today. If you're new to the channel, I have a 2008 Evo 10 and we've done a lot to it. I'll link the videos up above, but now it's time to paint my various parts and to get these on the car because this is going to be a complete game changer. So we have the Varus V1 from Bumper and then I have a carbon lip that goes underneath which is currently on Devin's Evo right now. I gotta steal that back. And then we have the side skirts and we have the carbon underboards as well. We're gonna sand these down and get them ready to paint. What grit? What grit? What do you mean? What grit are you gonna sand them with? I don't know, probably like 300. It's close. I just got done getting the bumper prepped for paint, so that's good to go. I just got done doing one of the skirts, and then I have one last skirt to do. Devin's in here. Devin, can you explain what you're doing? She had a dent right here, a pretty good sized dent. So we decided, well, the whole front end's getting blended, fixing her dent. Nice. Now we have to go to the paint shop, get paint for the car. We also should today do a spray out card make sure it's gonna match. I wanna show you guys the color because this car looks like a gray, like a really dark gray, but where'd that piece go? Oh, there it is. It's, it's a, sick. It's actually like a brown, brown flake, like a Java. Hi you guys, it's a few days later. Don't mind the way I look right now. I am going to be working all day so I didn't do my hair and makeup. We are going to be paint correcting my Evo today. We were going to paint all these parts, but we are waiting on paint to be matched at the paint shop so it's taking a little longer because of the weekend. So we decided we're going to polish her today. We just got done clay barring the car, washing it like a million times. I just went over it with some IPA and Devin's gonna teach me how to polish it. We have two polishers, Devin's gonna bust one side out and then I'm gonna do the other. I'm excited for this because this color is so pretty. It has like a very, it's like a mocha brown undertone which I'm super excited to see out in the light but without further ado, let's get going you guys. Okay, I'm gonna update you guys on how this whole polishing thing is going. It's actually a lot of fun. The only thing is I'm a perfectionist. So I, if you guys saw on the time lapse, I have been looking for the tiniest scratches and I keep going back and seeing another one. So I'll go back again and try to get it. I feel like the more I do this though, the more I'll have like a, a system down. But look at how pretty, let me grab this. Look how pretty that paint is. It's like a, it's like gold flakes. Here's the final outcome and you guys, she looks amazing. And then we ended up putting this carbon vortex generator on. I got this a really long time ago. It'll look a lot better when the wing is on it. We just have to wait to get the right paint to paint all those parts and then Barry is gonna be looking fire. It's a few days later. This is probably one of the weirdest vlogs I've ever put together of getting Barry put together, but we finally got a paint match and Devin has the paint booth blown up today and we're going to be painting the parts for Barry. So this is what the paint booth looks like if you guys haven't seen it before. And he's just masking off everything to get ready to spray. 
which is super exciting. There's not much I can do just because I don't paint myself, but let's go take a look inside. My fenders that Devin is blending, and then we have my wing, my rear spats, and my hood, which Devin is also blending too. This has been one of the longest and stretched out YouTube videos I've ever done. We are repainting my whole entire Evo 10. So you're just not on Well, yeah, because we've just been sanding and so I didn't want to record anything. But since the last clip, it's been about a week and a half to two weeks. So pretty much what happened, if you guys didn't catch that, is we repainted the Varus parts and the hood and everything and the color didn't end up matching and I wasn't able to record that because literally the next day we were sanding down the parts to be resprayed. So yeah, now um, we're at the point where we need to figure out what color to paint the car. And I gotta show you guys what, uh, what a berry looks like right now. We have been mostly Devin, but I have been too sanding down this whole entire car and we're gonna be respraying it a completely different color nothing crazy from what the stock color is so i think i'm just gonna go a little bit darker with the color but um long story short color didn't match we decided that we're gonna make this car just look a little bit darker and my dad is actually going to help Devin spray this at his business, which is a collision center. So he's been painting for years, like literally since he was young. Yeah, he's been spraying for decades, very, very long time. So he's helped Devin a lot with paint, but because we're putting so much work into this car, Devin wants us to like turn out perfect and for my dad to mix the paint and all that good stuff. This is what Barry's looking like right now. I'm working on the stock bumper, so I'm just sanding it down with this. But you guys, I'm gonna get back to work and I'm not gonna record this. So I will see you guys in the morning because in the morning we're dropping this car off at my dad's shop and prepping it to get painted. This is an exciting day because we are picking out the color for my car. So we're not doing the stock color. Like I said, we're doing a darker color and we just went to my dad's shop, picked out some paint that we liked, brought it here to compare, and this is what we came up with. This color right here, it's like a blue black. This one right here has gold flake in it, but it's like a very dark black. And then this is my stock color on the car. So that's what that is. And then this color, you guys, is what I'm leaning towards, and it's Java. What is it, babe? Java Black Pearl 18 ounce. Java Black Pearl, and Devin says it's a, it comes on 04 like STI or for any 04 Subaru. If it's black, it's usually Java Black Pearl. Yep. I think it's 04 only. So you're going back in time. So can you can you hold up the colors for me really quick to show them? So original paint, and then. It's definitely more of a yellow, but we're not painting the jams. It's not gold. Yellow, it's gold. <laughs> we're not painting the jams, so we don't want it to be too much different. I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to go with the Java Black Pearl on an 04 STI. A very, very, um, what's the word? Exquisite. Exquisite color. We just have to finish sanding down some things. We're actually going to pull the glass on this car. Apparently, my seals are very messed up so we need to redo that anyways the next morning we made it to my dad's shop and we have barry inside of the shop and we are still finishing up a little bit of prep work what i'm doing right now is wiping down all the jams because from my understanding devin's gonna be taping and masking everything off and we need a clean surface for that to stick to so I'm just going through all the jams right here and making them nice and clean. And Devin, Devin's doing some technical crafty stuff. We will eventually be able to get Barry inside of the paint booth. And I think we're gonna do that tomorrow. Day is 
is the day my Evo 10 is finally getting sprayed and I say finally because as you guys have been watching this has been such a long process it's been three weeks of going through of paint correcting my car to repainting the parts that we got to sanding everything down to repaint it and today's the day that Devin and my dad are respraying my car so right now my dad and Devin are at my dad's auto body shop um, and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna pick them up some coffee also I am now daily driving the black STI one of Devin's cars which is actually a ton of fun it's a lot like Gary just not as built obviously but it's a lot of fun it kind of feels like home. I don't want to interrupt them, but they're both in there. My dad's head is right there, and then Devin's in front of the car. But look at Barry, you guys. She looks so crazy. Looks like they're sanding. Maybe a little bit more. I'm not too sure. Okay, and then this is the room where all the parts are. They got both skirts, got all the bumpers and the wings, and then all the small parts over here. Devin's just going around and blowing off any access, dust, particles, dirt, excess. This is the moment of truth. It's the end of the day and they have been painting all day long. A car just got done baking not too long ago. And I want you guys to see the color because it's pretty freaking, it's pretty, it's pretty nice. Exquisite, quite gold. Do you have the sun, sunlight on you? You gotta go get the sunlight. I got you. It's so bright in here. It turned out so good and I'm so thankful for my dad and Devin. Okay, this is the light that you can really see everything. Do the trunk, because it's the best. Ba, ba, da, ba, ba. No, no. A little bit of solvent. That's like the prettiest color I've ever seen. Yeah, you know, Subaru really just knocked that out of the park back in 2004. So does it look like a Subi yet? Yeah. What we're gonna do is unmask it, and then we just brought Devin's trailer here. We're gonna load her up in the trailer, get all the parts, and head back to her home. Whenever I'm really tired, my eyes get like super, super red and I just look crazy right now, but it's been a long day. So we got Barry out here and then we have all of the bumpers. We have the Varus bumper, the stock bumper, all the skirts and mis miscellaneous parts are right over there. Devin just pulled around the trailer because as you guys can see, we can't necessarily drive this car anywhere right now without the windows. We gotta load her up and bring her back to the shop. This is gonna be the moment of truth. We have Barry in the shop and Devin spent yesterday putting all the little stuff back on the car. So that's all of the panels in the inside and the door handles and we put some seals in, the windows back in. We have it like, Mm, I'd say 60, 70% done. So now we have all the big stuff. We have the Varus side skirts, the Varus bumper, or Varus, Varus, Varus. And then we have the regular bumper to put back on. Don't know if I'm gonna drive the car today. I'm a little nervous. We still have to buff it and make it look pretty. Oh, and also we have the stock wheels on right now. So we need to get my amazing wheels back on. Sometimes in life, you just knock it out of the park. This time we did.
honestly speechless with the way Barry turned out. All thanks to Devin with his hard work and hours he's put in and my dad. But you guys, this is Devin and I's by far our favorite Evo we have built, I think. Like, look at this car. It looks green under the light right now, but it's just like so gold. Leave a comment down below, you guys. Let me know what you think. I'm kind of thinking about changing the color on the wheels, maybe. I don't know, this kind of, this goes really well with the car though. Front lip is fire. We're still gonna paint correct this car, so we didn't put on the gurney flap. We just have the stock wing on it, and then we also didn't put the vortex generator on it because we'd have to remove those anyways. But I'm gonna wrap up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about Barry and the new look we have for her. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.